What's up, you guys? Hey, everyone. Welcome back to our channel today. Oh, yeah. The family's all back together. <laughs> we are back home in oh, Florida. It feels good, you guys. Although, oh I probably can tell I'm pretty sick. You guys, we are sorry we have missed a couple days. Yeah. Well, let's just say that the five hour jet lag is extreme. I don't think we've ever experienced anything like that. No, we haven't. And it took a toll on us. <laughs> yeah. Not only that, so that paired with sleep, paired with yeah. exhaustion from the trip itself. And as you guys saw from our last video, our ride home was non-stop. Oh Truly non-stop. We got off on one plane, literally boarded the exact same plane just so they could refuel it in order to get make the trip over to Miami. Yeah, if you haven't seen that video, make sure you go back and watch it. I look yeah. at it I'm like, man, we were just beat. So. I know. And so we had like zero sleep. Then when we got home, we had like a horrible jet lag. We couldn't sleep. So we were just not getting any sleep at all. I know. As you can tell, poor Jerry. I think it's hit him the worst because yeah. he did try and edit at least that video to get out to you yeah. guys. Yeah. But I was like, you know what? We need to take just a couple days off, try and get our I'm doing. I'm doing back. a little bit better, but I will admit my throat's pretty sore. I got tons of congestion in my nose. My nose is constantly running. The big thing too is we wake up every night at yeah. like 1.32 and we cannot go back to sleep. So yeah, 1.30 or 2, we were just like instantly just wake up and it's just like, oh. I tried some melatonin last night to help. I helped a little bit, but I still woke up, which is I know. Crazy. We try like purposely staying awake, but we'll eventually just find ourselves like sleeping on a chair or just like, <laughs> you know, sitting up in bed and falling asleep. Oh my gosh. So gotta love that coming yeah. back to the time adjustment. But I will say coming back to this oh, little guy makes yes. it all worth it. We missed him <laughs> so much. It was so much fun having him back. I know. Look, like, he's just been our little cuddle bug He's been the last so snuggly. Days. I love it. Like usually he snuggles with Britt, not so much with me. But yeah, but he's, he's been, been snuggling, snuggling so much with I'm gonna, me too. Yeah. I'm going to let him down so we can go hunt some lizards. Ooh, We've been yeah. lizard hunting today. Yeah. The weather here in Fort Lauderdale, you guys, it's actually very overcast and like nice. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah, it's actually pretty nice. So it feels kind of nice. We were actually talking about the weather while we were out in Hawaii was incredible. Mm -hmm. Like we have been to Hawaii quite a few times and it always seems to pour quite a bit. This trip, it, it only rained one time at night. Also, a ton of you were wondering okay so we got home <laughs> and Michelle and Nora were here what happened to Britt's mom and dad it actually worked out that Michelle wanted to spend some time with them as well and yeah. they were leaving a few days before we got back so Michelle came out she spent a few days her and Nora with my mom and dad which was so special she was so excited about that and then she stayed a few extra days to watch spin for us yeah which was awesome huge lifesaver for us otherwise we would have been not in the best situation I know <laughs> we're just gonna sit down here for a second yeah I'm getting a little winded I did see quite a few comments saying, okay, why are you out in Hawaii? You were a little confused. Yeah, so we're actually out there for my job, Adventure Hunt. So Adventure Hunt, we do corporate retreats for companies. So we take out on these really epic, fun corporate retreats. We've done Panama before, we have one in Hawaii. Anyway, the one that we went on that you guys saw was out in Hawaii. Yeah. And I will say this, it was a ton of work. I was either going to bed at like 4 a.m., or like 3 a.m. Pretty much I never went to bed before p.m. <laughs> they worked so hard to make sure the group that they took out had a ton of fun. Yeah. Which obviously it's awesome. We get to go on a lot of the excursions too and tag along, but Jared worked so hard. Yeah. There's a lot of planning that goes into it, preparation. Well, there's all that, but then we obviously want to film it and create this really cool content for you guys because it's really fun to show you guys as well. Yes. But I'll say I have to edit that. As so afterwards. he was working like double <laughs> overtime. So no wonder he is exhausted yeah. and tired. Let's just say we're not going to even call Hawaii a vacation because it was no. I actually a think trip. we need a vacation. What do you guys think we, we should do? Really do need a vacation from that. And then I went and I helped with a lot of the cooking. So I yeah. was up at like 4:30 a.m. getting set yeah. for breakfast. In fact, there was one night that she woke up the same time that I went to bed. Yes. <laughs> I wish I could have shared more of the food we made with you. A ton of you guys were asking about that. Maybe I'll do that in another video because I know a lot of the time you're looking for easy dinner, lunch, breakfast ideas for a big group. So I'll share that with you, just not in this video because I'm kind of <laughs> sick of cooking. Yeah. I can't wait to get back into just some of our routines. We miss doing our little walks. Yeah, our little walks with Finn, just kind of our day-to-day -day schedule. We need to get caught up on a bunch of emails. We've really just taken the last two days easy, you guys. We've yeah. just kind of... Oh, we had so much fun out there though. I think it legitimately took it out of us. It we did on a really waterfall <laughs> hike where we jumped off waterfalls. We did another hike where we went down like a water slide. Oh my god. We gosh. did the shark dive. We drove like a sweet little navy boat. We did a helicopter ride over oh a volcano. Gosh. 
We did so much. We swam with manta rays. We went snorkeling so much. <laughs> we went paddle boarding. Yeah. There was, it was just go, 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 go. Usually on vacation, you know, you do those things and then you have some time to like relax, yeah. like at the beach. But for us, as soon as we get back to the place we were staying at, it was like, okay, work time, dinner, grocery shopping, Costco haul, like just boom, yeah. boom, 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 boom. Yeah. Absolutely loved our time in Hawaii, but we love being home <laughs> now. Okay, you guys, we are dying. Finn is having the time of his life, stopping at like every bush, every tree, looking for lizards. Finn, do you see any? Look how cute it is when he gets up on his little hind legs. Finn, you gotta be Good careful boy. with those thorns in there. Come here, Come let's on, go dude. see if they're over here. Come on. Good job, dude. He is so excited, it's <laughs> so dang cute. You guys, everything's blooming again here in Florida. Pretty soon these bushes will be all Even covered. No parking signs. Yeah. <laughs> Oh wow. We oh were just my gosh. talking about that car. That's yellow Corvette. There's usually lizards over here. Let's see if we can capture them for you guys. Okay, Finny. Are any out? Where, Where are, are they? Go get them. Where are they? He's looking. <laughs> Where are they? There's none of them around right now. Where are they? Where are they? I love how he does the whole perimeter. <laughs> he, really he has the whole curb. <laughs> Starts there and does the whole thing. Come here, Aunt Jim. Can you jump up there? Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Can you jump? Do you see me? Jump, jump, jump. I don't see anything. Come on. He's looking for the squirrel. Jump up. Oh, you got it. Good boy. <laughs> Keep going. Go, 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 go. Are you kidding go, me? Boy. He's climbing the tree. Go, okay, Jeremy, be careful. Good job, dude. <laughs> That was, that was so, so awesome. funny. That was awesome. <laughs> Okay guys, we just got back home. Little Finn, I just have to zoom in on his face. He is one happy little puppy. Look at that smile. He was honestly just running up and down the streets, in yards, like just everywhere. So that was so fun. That is the worst part about going out of town or traveling is leaving him. He I know, just... it's so much more fun when it's like I got so many messages over on Instagram saying we've missed Finn. I actually posted a really cute little video of Jared and him today. They were laying in bed and Finn is just on his back, just like <laughs> so happy looking up at Jared and then he looks at me and anyways, it just melted our hearts. He's just such a good little dog. There's nothing like coming home to like the love of a dog. They're just so stinking sweet. I finally got our suitcase is put away the place we stayed at did have a washer dryer so i washed pretty much all of my clothes mm -hmm. and quite a few of jared's so oh, i didn't yeah. have a ton of laundry to do i have one load going right now i'm calling that a win for today because they've been sitting in our room for the last two days yeah because <laughs> just didn't have the energy to put them away i think finn's finally at ease that the suitcases are out of sight out of mind as well because <laughs> yeah. we all know he gets really nervous when he sees suitcases come out it's so nice just to be in our own little house I just know. us i know we haven't had anything like this in a long time we were talking about that how it is really nice just to have us as much as we love our family we love visitors you guys we know love that. it even more when you're not here yeah we love it even more when they're gone <laughs> You guys, I'm really <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, no, but it is nice to have a little break, have your yeah. own space, yeah. kind of do what you want. So yeah, I think we're gonna just work on some emails now. Oh yeah, I got some work stuff to do. Got some work stuff to do, and mm. then we'll check them together a little bit. Baking bread with Brit now, in session, baby. <laughs> Okay, I decided, you know what, I had some food, and instead of eating out, I did want to cook something, because it's a whole different story, cooking for two rather than 30. Yeah, 
Right after she had said, like, I'm not gonna want to cook anymore. I know. <laughs> I could say, but you know what? We haven't had our lemon puffer salmon for a long time. I know, and this is so and easy to make. It's so good, it's so healthy. So I think you guys ask about this as much as our cinnamon rolls, I almost. Know. This and the cinnamon rolls are our two most popular recipes. And if you're new to our channel, or have to be new, this is lemon pepper salmon. So I just have some salmon fillets. I got these from Trader Joe's. It has the skin on. But I put them down on a cookie sheet in foil. And it's pretty much the easiest recipe ever. Yeah. I just take quite a bit of butter. <laughs> a ton of butter. <laughs> yeah, that's what makes it so good though, because what's worse than dry salmon? Nothing. <laughs> so I just take a ton of butter, rub it around. I put some butter down like on the bottom too, so it won't stick to the tin foil. And I'm actually putting a little extra butter down because I use the melted butter with the lemon sauce over rice. So it's kind of like you're making the sauce all in one packet. And all I do is I take some lemon pepper seasoning and I just generously put it over <laughs> the salmon. And then when it's done, I will actually take fresh lemon and squeeze it over it before serving. But yeah, I just roll this up into a foil packet, oven at 375 for about like 15 minutes. I always keep my eye on it because it just depends how thick your fillets are. But I'm gonna serve that with a little rice and you know, Boom. just about ready. Mm. So I decided to come out here and just close out the vlog. I have not been out here. I haven't shown you guys out here in a long time. It's actually pretty darn windy today, so I do apologize about that, but it's kind of nice to see our balcony view at night. I've loved this view, I've missed this view. Anyways, you guys, it is actually only like 9 p.m., but we're gonna close out today's video. So if you guys are new to our channel, definitely hit that subscribe button. Make sure you guys come on back. We have tons of fun things planned. Plus, we have more visitors coming just right around the corner. I cannot believe it's already time for that. And these are visitors that you guys have not seen before, which we are stoked about. But anyways, since I am not feeling so hot, I am gonna cut it early tonight because I need to go in, go to sleep. I am dead tired, my throat hurts. So with that, you guys, we love you so much. And until tomorrow, we'll see you later. Bye.